hello there welcome to my channel if you're new here welcome on my channel i do new fragrance reviews and subscription unboxings today i want to share my thoughts or first impression if you say if you must say uh on the new fragrance from parfum de marley oriana but before we get into it don't forget to like comment and subscribe also, please stay to the end of the video for updates on my giveaway. Scent of the day is from Parfum de Marley as well. This one is Cassily. It's peachy, creamy. I grabbed this one for um, like, okay, I'm going to spice it up a little bit today. I want to feel cute. Yeah, this is what I go for. Love it. I found out about the new release and ran to the PMD store to see if I could try it and pick up a sample. It retails for $320, so I wanted to play around with it first before committing to, you know, an expensive fragrance. The only place that have it right now is on their site, as it's sold out in stores and at Saks Fifth Avenue. And when I got there... I, was, I went there on my way to work. I work in Manhattan. So it was like a five minute walk before, um, away from work. I was told samples won't be available until the 1st of October. And that was uh, <laughs> disappointing. So she, um, the lady sprayed it on me. So that's what I have decided to use to share my experience with you. So it's like more like a first impression. So I don't have the full size and I don't have the um the sample. I don't have the full size to show you, but I'll post a picture of it so you have an idea of what it looks like. Let's start with the packaging. It's a beautiful, let me tell you. It's a beautiful bright pink fuchsia. It's opaque, just like how Cassie, Cassie is. And I also have Delina. So it's the same type of bottle, same shape, same bottle. The tassel on it is pink. Just like how the pink, light pink is here that matches this. It's the same bright pink up there on the, on the, um, the Oriana beautiful it stands out i won't lie um i think a lot of people are going to get pulled in because of the color and i'm guessing that's why it's sold out in stores um it will look beautiful on any vanity it will it's i mean if if you've never seen it again i'll post a picture beautiful it's described as a um, fruity floral gourmand. The top notes are mandarin, mandarin orange, grapefruit, and bergamot. The middle notes are orange blossom, raspberry, and blackcurrant. Base notes are marshmallow, whipped cream, musk, and amber. So when she sprayed this cuteness on me, the opening is beautiful. I got um, a huge burst of citrus from the bergamot and the grapefruit. Then shortly after that, um, the mandarin orange came forward. Since it's my first impression and that's the only time I've tried it, I must say, at that time, I didn't get the raspberry nor the black currant. But as a transition, I got a slight musk. Just a slight musk, nothing too crazy. But in the dry down, I feel like everyone it was or everyone is looking forward to this Chantilly cream or whipped cream. Some some notes will say, and the marshmallow combination. People, I think, are really looking forward to that, and that's what I was. I'm looking. I was looking forward to. To to, but um. On the dry down, it got sweet, but not sickly sweet, not crazy sweet. But I got it more from the whipped cream than the marshmallow. It smelled like a sweet, creamy floral. 
or creamy fruity floral on my skin on the dry down so um i went to work after leaving the pnb store and i asked my co-workers for their thoughts on it as you know i'm looking forward to all or any feedback on this fragrance because it's expensive mind you i don't even know i blind bought <laughs> cast lily well when i got it it wasn't my favorite but it warmed up to me but i don't i'm still as um before i if i do get this i have to get feedbacks on um on it so i i asked my um co-workers the guys thought it was a beautiful scent as they thought it's sweet and men love sweet fragrances on women. They thought it would be great for date nights and intimate setting. And as the perfume stayed on my skin, I understood why. Females thought it was similar to Love Don't Be Shy from Killian. I don't own that one, so I can't compare I don't remember ever smelling. If I did smell it at Sephora, I don't remember, you know. As for Oriana, the Siage is great or was great. Performance, on the other hand, is where everyone, where the disappointment came in for, it, for most people. It's not a Safanade. If you guys have ever tried PMD Safanade, you know she is uh, Delina and Delina. I'm telling you, baby. Her? This one. She. Oh my God. Beast. When you say beast, I don't regret getting this. And this will forever be in my collection. Yeah, uh, it's not a beast. It gets softer the longer it stayed on my skin. And it created a little bubble on around me. And this is why I said um, I understand or understood why the guy said it's perfect for intimate setting. Because it didn't turn into a skin scent right away. But it was soft. And with movements, I could still smell it. I, was still, I, I still remember that I have it on. But it wasn't something that was like strong. If you came into my space, then you would smell it on me. If you leaned over for an uh, for a hug, you would smell it on me. Um, I love it. I just wish that for the price point, it had a better performance. Um, I'm going to wait to play around more with the samples because I'm tempted. I was tempted still tempted i keep checking sacks i'm tempted to um get the full size but i really really i'm trying to hold out and wait to play around with the samples and see if i can get some samples or a sample of the love don't be shy to compare them and see which one i would lean more to um i wouldn't recommend you blind buying this especially from the PMD store or the PMD site, they do not accept returns nor exchange. I did check that first. That's why I'm here waiting for Saks to restock because um, if you buy this, blind buy this and you don't love it, then you're stuck with it. If you buy this, if you go ahead now and buy this from the, their website, you're going to be stuck with this if you don't love it and you'll probably have to try and resell it or something. And it's too expensive to be stuck with right now. Um, Like I said, I would um, recommend you to blind buy it as people might be um, disappointed with its performance. If you decide to get this for someone though, like if you decide to give this, the bottle alone will win their hearts. I mean, so these are my thoughts on this fragrance. Please comment. Please share below in the comments if you got your nose on it. If you did come into the full size. Just let me know how you feel about it. So I must say thank you for the 30 people that's here. It feels like a hundred. I really, really, really get, appreciate you guys. 
So as promised, I'm going to go ahead and do this giveaway. Today is Saturday. I am going to wait until tomorrow after. Um, tomorrow night to select I'm gonna randomly select the person who's gonna get this gift from me all you have to do is um, leave your IG handle down below or your email address so I can reach out to you please 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 look out for that tomorrow into tomorrow Sunday into Monday I will give you maybe 24 hours to reply. If not, then I'll move on, move on to someone else. So thank you again, guys. Thank you. I really, really appreciate you. Until then, take care.